So with the crazy and spectacular collapse of the FTX exchange, it's fully filed for bankruptcy. The token went from 30 to $1.30. It's not really so great. And just to add on top of that, people are pretty furious that SBF even has the balls to come out for an interview. Like, it's not a small interview. Like, we're talking about the New York Times Deal Book Summit. There's a lot of controversy. People are saying, why is SPF coming out even after the bankruptcy, okay? Like, a lot of people lost their money. Like, one guy lost the most, a little over $200 million, all from a single wallet. Remember, FTX Exchange was heavily over leveraged in a series of really crazy events. It's very complicated, but remember, SPF isn't even in the U.S. since there's already investigations going on. He's in the Bahamas right now. So if you check out some of these really, really crazy tweets here, you do have Andrew Ross Sorkin, okay? He's going to be doing a lot of the interviewing. He's saying that a lot of folks have been asking if there will be interview with SPF at the New York Times. Absolutely yes. It's going to be a summit on November 30th. There's going to be a lot of important questions to be asked. And if you're wondering if you're going to be getting your money back if you lost an FTX, probably not. Okay. So it's going to be a pretty big interview. I think it's going to be an interview that will definitely clear things up. There's a ton of rumors, a ton of things to talk about. There's even rumors that SPF isn't even in the Bahamas. He's probably somewhere in Argentina. Okay. So it's like some really wild rumors. There's a lot of people talking about how SPF is a big disgrace. You know, after this massive bankruptcy, you still actually come out and do a bunch of interviews. So just, people just don't like it, but I'm all for the interview. I'm really curious to see what he has to say. I think he's prepared to be saying a lot of big things. And by the way, a lot of other exchanges have collapsed simply because they had so much money in FTX exchange. With the second biggest exchange in the world being heavily over leveraged, plus a crypto winter, and also plus over leveraging and just mismanagement of massive funds. This is what you get, okay? People have been asking, is SPF gonna be traveling to New York City for the interview? Probably not, okay? In fact, there's been clarifications that he will be doing it through online in the Bahamas. And you kind of see why. He's very, very unpopular in the crypto countries, especially the United States. He's been there for quite some time. Every single piece of news media is talking about it. Okay, it's getting to the point that even my dog knows about SPF. So this is what's going on, and I'll be tuning in the interview. Don't forget the dates, November 30th. It's going to be a really, really big deal. And as for the FTX token, not really that much volume. Nobody's really trading it. Nobody's really pumping it. It's just completely dead.